What's going on, y'all? We are back in the building for another Tech Talk. Let's get it. It's Player Talk Radio. Let's go. To Player Talk Radio with DJ Kuda, the hottest DJ in the manosphere. Let's get it. What's going on, y'all? It's Player Talk Radio. It's DJ Kuda right back at the helm of today's show. Got a great tech show for you guys today. I'm very excited, man. So excited. I got on my flight jacket. I don't have my pilot's hat just yet, but I do have a matching cigar. On today's show, man, we're going to smoke the Xeno Platinum. Well, not on today's show because this is for a special occasion. And today's show is a special occasion. I'm always happy to present to you guys new tech because I'm always presenting new tech to you guys. So let's get straight into tonight, uh, tonight's show or today's show or whenever you're watching this, let's get straight into the show. Let's get it. It's Player Talk Radio. Well, let's get over into uh, the next slide. So I've explained to you guys about you know some of the new things that i've been getting into and some of the new things that i've been getting into you know it's like looking at like like helicopters uh uh like flights aviation airplanes all kinds of stuff right and one of the things that i've uh that i've been researching was drones and um you know uh to to my surprise you know, uh, drones are a really big thing. Like I've been telling y'all that, you know, drone technology is going to be one of the biggest things of the future. I wanted to get into drones, learning how to fly drones, learning a lot about drones and, you know, uh, owning a drone. Now, I had a drone, but it was like a little toy drone, something that you play around with in your house and stuff. But it was pretty cool. And it actually had a camera on it. I'm not sure exactly uh what the camera shot in i'm pretty sure it was like 720 or maybe uh like uh uh maybe 1080 i don't know they're they're putting a lot of powerful cameras on these small drones and it's just crazy to see how far we've come uh you know from like like landing airplanes with like the fraction of a second you know like the timing of a landing uh this big ass uh this big ass uh Hind D behind me, which is like a Russian gunship, is a big ass piece of machine. Like big stuff like that don't have no business flying. You understand what I'm saying? So what I'm saying is that you know I was you know studying you know uh, different types of crafts and stuff. I've always uh, liked uh, you know uh, the Hind D ever since I played Metal Gear Solid. You know, uh, and I seen that he helicopter. I was like Jesus Christ, and then to like really really see one like in real life and stuff and like look at it i was like god damn that's a that's a that's a huge helicopter you know what i'm saying and this is a big bird man this is this is this this helicopter is no joke this is a no joke helicopter like 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 this is the last thing a lot of people seen this is the last thing you want to see you know what i'm saying when it comes down to war look at the gun look at the god dang look at the gun on that joint but anyway, look at the cock the cockpit. Imagine trying to maneuver one of these things. You know what I'm saying? How huge it is. And you got to watch out for your propellers and you got to be, you know, very, you know, very cognizant and wary of how, you know, big these drones are. I mean, not these drones, but these helicopters are. And now as uh, you know, as a as a as a you know just a, a regular citizen you can own a drone you can own something that defies defies air and cuts it at the at the speed of, of at the speed of god you know at, at the speed of whatever you want to think of faster than this huge helicopter without using all of these buttons 
But you do have to go to flight school when you uh when you're learning. You do have to know everything a pilot knows and stuff like that. Actually, they say flying the drone is actually the uh you know the 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 least of your problems. You know, uh, learning how to you know uh, maneuver and all that other stuff. Yeah, you can go on YouTube and learn that. You have to go to pilot school and really learn what you know some of these guys know. You know, talking to the Talking to the flight authority, um, learning your flight zones. You get a GPS. You can't just fly it everywhere. You got to look, go to, you know, you got to look at local state regulations, how heavy is the craft and, you know, where you're going to be flying, scheduling the flight and things like that. Like, you know, you know, it's not just having fun in your backyard playing around with the drone, even though that's what I'm going to do, but. What I'm saying is that, you know, you, there's a lot of precautions and things that you have to do. And, you know, we fast forward to 2020, almost 2021, and not even, even before 2020, you know, where, you know, drones are becoming more of a thing with, you know, air traffic and things like that and what goes on, you know. And today I want to show y'all something because y'all know me. I don't just talk about it. I be about it. I actually have a brand new drone that I want to show you guys today. So thank you guys for definitely liking and supporting the channel. Can't do it without you. But we in here. Um, this is just a nice little quick, you know, uh, a uh, video of, uh, you know, me kind of, you know, showing y'all some of the stuff that I like to do. Some of the things that I like to do. Wait until I start getting the trains. That's it, man. When I start when I start showing y'all train collections and stuff, that's when I really went off the deep end. So, uh, the DJI Mini 2, I didn't know. I was looking at so much videos on the DJI Mini 2. Uh, is the latest, newest drone that I have to show you guys today. Um, I didn't know this was a vent until looking at this picture. I was like, dang. And look at this gimbal right here. This gimbal, this is the this is the camera that rotates all over the place and looks and stuff. Um, you know, uh just a beautiful drone. Uh specked out. You know what I'm saying? Excuse me for my, my terrible lit green screen, y'all. But look at it. It's specked out. You know, you got uh, you know, you got you got the wings and everything. It folds up. You can fit it in your pocket. You know, intelligent modes and quick shots. Ultra clear 4K video. You know, uh, the the you know the transmission on the on the um on the uh, the signal because it goes very far. And then I saw something uh for like twelve bucks that you can hook onto it and it can go even even further. It has a level five wind resistance. Uh uh, thirty one minutes flight time. Ultra light and foldable, and it weighs 249, I think, grams, I think they say. And to, you know, you have to, you, you know, you have to register, you know, these drones in your, you know, in your state or in your, in your city, you know what I'm saying, to, to be able to fly them because, you know, you can't be over a certain, uh, a certain, you know, uh, you know, weight limit or, you know, certain, uh, uh, I think they say grams or whatever. And that's 250. So anything under, t uh, 250, you know, they say it's a toy. So basically they're like, oh shit, really? Bet. All right. So we're going to be a toy. We just going to make our mini even smaller. And I think it's not even 249. They say it's 237 grams you know uh weight or or 237 like it is is it's very small i've never had one i've never held one and you know i don't know what to tell y'all but to go from this huge beast of a plane of, of a helicopter right here you know that can <laughs> them joints be be side scrolling and doing all kinds of stuff and that gun you see how the you see how the drone has a gimbal? Oh, oh, these Russians, they got a Putin in them, they got a gimbal for you. That's a that's a this a real gimbal. This this gun right here, this gun right this, that's a gimbal for you. 
That's a real gimbal. And, and don't and don't think you don't think that light right there it, it, it ain't, ain't gonna find you and that gimbal ain't gonna search you out. This gimbal spins. You wanna see something that really spins, it didn't this. <laughs> Let me stop playing. So I don't just talk about it. Ugh. I need to really start moving this microphone. I be about it, y'all. Y'all thought I was going to just sit up here and just talk about a dang drone and not even show y'all the dang drone. Now, I'm pretty sure you guys see a lot of guys that just, you know, they just do reviews. Like, they just, they just talk about it, show y'all pictures and stuff. Nah, and we're going to we're going to get some flight footage later on. Now, I ordered a landing gear for this drone and it hasn't come yet. They said it'll come Friday. So hopefully by Friday. I like how sometimes, you know, they couple it. Halfway through the delivery. And you're like, hey, my my landing gear came. Also, uh, you know, uh, doesn't I don't think it has any onboard memory. So I got this, uh, you know, this SD card. Uh, it's a mini 128, and it goes to this bigger one because at some point I'm gonna have to, if I can't Bluetooth it to my computer. Look, you can Bluetooth a drone to your computer and transfer files. Amazing, and your phone. But I got the I I needed something with the adapter, so I could just hook it straight to my computer, and yeah, here it is, y'all. The DJI Mini Two. Read them and weep. Oh, and this is just not the DJI Mini Two. This is the Flight More pack. You know, you get the Fly More. I get three batteries, some propellers. A battery charger, uh, uh, you know, the controller that they have with the Mavic Air number two. This thing got OcuSync, guys, which is technology that they used for their Mavic. So it has up-to-date technology that they use for their bigger drones. And it's more intelligent. So. That's, that's, you know, that's a plus. So I got the fly more combo and, uh, the drone is said to be about like, you know, 400, you know, happy Thanksgiving to me, right? Hopefully, hopefully you guys are having a great Thanksgiving to you and yours. Hopefully this video drops by time Thanksgiving comes, you know? And, um... I can't wait to show y'all the Christmas gift. I'm going to get. Also, I'm going to try to do some giveaways if certain things come back into stock. It has something to do with the price and how much, um, the, the quality of uh, what I'm talking about and uh, what I want to give away. I actually have two giveaways coming up in the month of December. Stay tuned. All right. And if I don't make it a big announcement, y'all know I'd be giving away stuff behind closed doors. I just don't brag about it. But we have our DGI Mini. And um, this is awesome, y'all. I'm, I'm so excited. I know, I know, I know, and I just can't hide it. How you open this thing, man? Hold on, y'all. Ah, really refined. So... Unboxing it, you open it, and it's in the bag already. You get the bag and fumble it. I get the bag and flip it and tumble it. Hold on, y'all. Ah. Satisfying. You get this nice leather. Wow, this is nice, y'all. You get this nice leather bag that you can just, you know, you can take with you. 
you know, or you can, you can, you can hold it, you know. Awesome. Let's see what's in it. I wonder if it's a drone in it. Look, y'all, I bought a bag and it came with a drone. So open this, I guess. And um, and I don't think this is the the this, the, uh, the the part to open it, but it's another little compartment right here where you can carry, I guess, your documentation, should in case them peoples roll up on you. Hey man, why you flying that drone? You know, and they they're they're more impressed with paperwork than the actual drone. But I think how you open it is right here at the top, and it has a seal on it. Wow, I can see into it. Oh, this is awesome. It has a seal on it, so it kind of it kind of seals the zippers, maybe for weather. And wow, look at that. Look at that. You know, might want to read the documentation. Also, there's an actual pouch. I'm tired of doing this. I need to center this screen. There's an actual zip pouch right here on the inside. So if you want to carry more documents on how you're uh, able to fly this drone, we got an accessories uh, kit right here. Put that to the side. <laughs> I thought it was a CD disc. You know how usually stuff come with a CD-ROM? It probably is, though. Messing around. See what it is. We'll see. Okay. Wow. Here's the drone. And yes, it fits in the hand. And yes, it is very small. Wow. Look at this thing. Now, it feels metal and plasticky. Oh, this thing is pretty. Look at that. It looks like a frog. Now, if y'all listen to last night's show, Platinum says something about a frog, which is hilarious. <laughs> oh, Lord of mercy. Let me not let me not think about that. So, and this is the protector for the wings and stuff. You can always change the wings. Wow, look at the motors on this thing. And look at how the wings just kind of, they kind of motion. This thing is crazy. Now, I don't, now the motors look exposed. So you take this off. And you take that off. And the wings come loose. The wings come loose. But the motors are exposed. And what I mean by the motors are exposed is these little in the in you can see into it, you know. I don't have my actual camera camera where I can do displays, but I will have it soon. And um wow, you can check the battery, which I don't think it has, or maybe I have to pull this fly tab. Uh, right here, you can, let's see, untape this, and these wings come loose. These are some small wings, but they look like they gyrate and they rotate, like, really quickly. Really, uh, this is my first, like, real drone drone, you know what I'm saying? Drone, drone. I'm scared to put this thing in the air, y'all. I really am. Dang. So I tried. To, so I look. I tried to to pull this out to the side. I'm thinking like, it, it, you know, what I'm saying. I'm thinking it it goes around to the side, but it doesn't. It goes down. Wow. Goes down. Sturdy arm, too. These probably go to the side, do they? No. 
I don't know. Unfold front. Oh, this is the thing. These got to open first. Didn't even notice. These come out first. <laughs> These go down to the side. Wow. Wow, this is tight, y'all. This is tight. Now, I want to keep this thing on. But I think when you when you fly it, you got to take it off. And there's also uh I wonder if you can keep it on. Dang. This thing looks fragile. Like it's just this you could pull this forward. God dang, this thing it looks fragile as hell. I've seen this thing go through crash tests. This thing just looks fragile as hell, y'all. I'm scared, yo. I'm scared to fly this mother. <laughs> you know? Keep this joint in this gimbal. Dang, and this is supposed to go up in the air. I wonder. I'm keeping hold of this. I wonder if you could keep this on, but th this is it right here, bro. I'm scared to put this in, 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 uh, in the elements. But how to activate the battery? Am I gonna read that? Uh, I don't think so. Open the cover. Battery release. Move, remove the battery. That cargo. Wow. Real light, too. Yeah, I'm using that landing gear that I got for it. Whenever it comes. And the SD card goes right there. And USB-C. Remember, I started telling y'all. the uh, I don't know why it just got so quiet. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm just looking at shit. The USB-C is going to be the future for a lot of, uh, you know, for a lot of, uh, you know, technology. Now, let's see if it cuts on. Maybe you got to charge it. Speaking of charger, let me put this down. Damn, this thing looks crazy. Yeah, this, this is a serious <laughs> machine, y'all. Whoa, look at this controller, y'all. Look at this controller. Controller. Look at this controller. All oh, these buttons feel crazy. This is a controller controller. And the knobs are down here. You pull them out. Screw them in. And go. This got cine for cinematic. You got sport mode. And you got normal. This joint got a sport mode, y'all. Motorsport. <laughs> Put that thing in sport. Look at this joint, man. So, we'll see. And this right here is the antenna. Now, I don't know how it comes out. Let's see. Yeah. This right here is the antenna. And you put your phone right here. And I was looking at it. They said it can fit. The new iPhone 12. So you fly it. Um, I don't know if these are buttons or not. I heard this is to control the gimbal. Which is tight. You can take a picture with this one. Uh, These buttons. they just, Oh shoot. It turns on y'all. Oh it turned on. Just touching buttons. Oh man. 
It turns on, y'all. These right here are the knobs for it. You take that, screw it in. That's what she said, right? Oh yeah. Oh my God. This is this is gonna be. So... <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm about to get up out of here. <laughs> you about to go have some fun. Good Lord, you got a vent back there for whatever reason. I think it talks to you. Your controller don't talk to you. <laughs> Let me stop. Oh, man. Do some man shit when, once in a while, man. A man and his toys, man. A man and his toys. What can I say? So we're going to take this. Let me stop playing now. We're going to take this, and we're going to... uh. Oh, man, and, and I got sufficient battery charge? Oh, Lord of mercy. You know, they should have never gave us technology. Hold on, y'all. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Hold on, y'all. Make sure I put this SD card in it before I forget. Oh, Lord of mercy, does it fit? Yes, it does. Yes, it did. Look at this light at the bottom. This thing got lights on it. Now, you're not supposed to fly at nighttime. Thank God it's white or gray or whatever it is. But you got to learn it sometime, y'all. Now, I'm trying to figure out how you cut this bad boy on, but I don't want to cut it on because when these blades get to moving and stuff and they get to hitting the screen, game over. You cut on outside. You cut on outside. Okay. So that's really all that comes with it. Put this in the bag. Just throw it in the bag. You got three major parts. I was thinking where... I thought this was the... Uh, the uh, the battery thing because they look so much alike, but it's not the battery thing. And like I said, look on the side of it, ultra light, 249, right? Here's the battery pack. Comes with, uh, wow, okay, yeah, there, there you go. Comes with, um, these accessories, which I think um you uh you uh put your uh your iPhone or whatever you're using onto it. This is how you charge it also. I see some USB C cables here. So these accessories are to, you know, charge and stuff. Which is pretty cool. And I guess to connect your phone too. So um Put this in the bag. Just hold on to that. Uh, let's see, some more cables. I guess this is how you'll hook it to your your computer. You have a uh. Hold on, y'all. You have a USB. To US uh a USB C to USB A cable. Here we go. This is what I'm talking about. The battery pack. You can actually charge your phone from the battery pack also. You don't want your phone dying. Now this is a odd. This charger right here. This is actually pretty odd. If you get an iPhone, theirs is a USB C. This one, which is pretty big, says DGI right here, is a USB-A. Odd. More goodies in the box. Oh, no more goodies in the box. Okay. Um, so, but keep in mind, a lot did come in this box, and I like the packaging. 
Trust me, I, uh, I've opened I've opened up several things here on Player Talk Radio, and I I think I know something or two about packaging, eh? About the packaging. Okay. Open this disc tray up. Back in the day, this used to be a CD. But uh, these this is all documentation. You know, in case y'all speak Japanese and stuff. Good stuff to know. Keep this documentation in the bag. Everything that comes with it. Oh, man. I was just about to say... I was just about to complain. I was about to be like, yo, I don't see these. It said it came with propellers. I don't see propellers. Look at these, y'all. They got the propellers in a nice little uh, bag. These are like pouches. And they got the screws for them. And I was just about to say, if, I wonder if it comes with a tool. Some more propellers. I wish they had different colors, though. That would be pretty cool. But I guess orange is very visible. Lord of mercy, these are a lot of propellers. How do you know if your propellers go bad? Wow, you get two more sticks. Awesome, awesome. And here's the tool to remove and uh, replace your propellers, I'm taking them. And that's about it. Um... Very interesting. Keep these in their respectable places. I'm going to take a look at some more uh, YouTube videos on when might be a good time to, you know, replace your propellers. And the motor. Well, not just the motor, but, you know, if the motor when it when and if the motor goes bad, let me check these pockets since DGI likes to hide stuff in their pockets. Put the documentation in the pockets. So that way when you're on the go, if there's anything you want to know, you can know when you're on the go. Now this is an awesome and this thing has so much different, you know, uh has so much different uh, knickknacks on it. I'm sounding old, y'all. Knickknacks? I wonder, though. Do I have to buy a special attachment for an iPhone? Because I don't see where I can hook my iPhone into this uh, device. But let's see. If I pull this up. When you pull this up right here. They got. Two things right here. Let's see if one of them is for the iPhone. You got to have nails nowadays man. Oh yeah. iPhone. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir, Ski. You got one for the iPhone. Okay, so that's what those are for. You have one for the iPhone, and you have one for the Android. And right here is a USB-C, and this is how you wrap it around, and you can tuck it into the... uh into the housing very cool and very sleek i like that me like that oh yeah me right that me definitely right that tuck it right there into the housing then bring it in the housing and these 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 pedals these pedals are like wow i can't wait to fly this thing man i'm 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 over here about to go crazy, y'all. And I can't wait till y'all see the footage that I captured. 
keep this. You know, that way holds your drone together. So I guess the bottom comes in first, right? Keep these down, keep these together. Top comes in behind. Keep these down, keep these together. And this looks like it goes like this. If I got it right before we get into this battery housing ordeal. And I knew I had it wrong. It goes this way. But you want to make sure these wings are tucked. Okay, I'll get it eventually. <laughs> Some <laughs> ten minutes later, man, man, screw this. Let me stop. Hold on, y'all. This is like the most uh, boring uh, unboxing you've ever seen. I need to hire an editor because I do not know what the hell I'm doing. Well, I, I don't know. It did work before. Or maybe I'm doing it wrong. Oh, duh. I don't know how to do it. And I ain't afraid to say I don't know how to do it. So we'll figure it out. Anyway, before I get up out of here and go fly this thing, This is, the, this is the good part about getting tech and gear. You got to learn how to do it. Here's the battery charger, and they got three of them ready to go. So if this thing is getting about, let's say, a half an hour flight time, I got about an hour and a half right here, an hour and 33 minutes, and that's not bad. You know, who needs to fly that long? And also, this thing charges your phone. You see? You can turn it on. You have an out, so you can plug your phone into it. And you have a USB in, which I'm pretty sure it plugs. I mean, it charges, you know, you know. Slide the batteries in. Slide the batteries in. Charge it, you know. So, thank you guys for... And eventually I will figure out how to uh, close this. And all of this stuff just fits right here in the bizag. Even if you don't, you know, if you have to quickly change locations. And this is a great bag, you know. I'm going to... Had the protective case and stuff. My bad for this long 40-minute montage of me playing around with toys. I'm going to enjoy my Platinum Zeno cigar. $33 cigar. The maker of, uh, of, of Davidoff. We just out, man. Thank you for coming through. It's Player Talk Radio. I want to let you guys know that um uh I, I, I don't know. I don't I don't know what I want to let you guys know. I'm about to go fly. Look out for some footage. New player talk radio shows are coming. We out. It's DJ Kuda. And why is Wavelink telling me there's a new version available while I'm doing this? Install the update. All right, y'all, we out. It's player talk. Let's get it. Let's go. Shout outs to the drone flyers. We out.
How the hell do you fly this thing? Girl, thank you, girl. Sprinkle, sprinkle.